वी आर डिस्कसिंग टूडे अबाउट रोटेटर कफ पोर्टफोलियो ऑफ कॉन्मेट लिनवाटेक कॉन्मेट लिनवाटेक इज वन ऑफ द पायनियर्स इन रोटेटर कफ रिपेयर एंकर एंड दे हैव मेड सम वेरी गुड इनोवेशन विच हैव मेड रोटेटर कफ रिपेयर वेरी इजी सो वी विल गो ऑन विद वन बाय वन एंकर एंड वॉट आर द प्रॉस एंड कॉन्स एंड हाउ दीज एंकर शुड बी यूज now we we'll start with one prototype anchor now this anchor is called as a trivo ft5 mm anchor now this is a titanium metal anchor if you see this is a titanium metal anchor and it is a very unique titanium anchor as compared to any other anchors which are available so we'll just explain you how and why so when you take this anchor out this anchor is a fully threaded anchor normally in metallic anchors what you will see is there will be a eye here and the threads will be passing in through the eye but in this particular anchor there is no eye the anchor is passing into the threads itself so all the threads are passing into the anchor itself and that throat on the tip so it is basically the anchor is made up in two parts one part is here and the second part is here and it has got a fully threaded architecture and the anchor inserter is sort of a screw head and there is no eyelet so the fixation of the anchor is complete and we get a full complete fixation whenever we use this sort of an anchor so despite being a metal anchor it is a non eyed anchor and that's why it gets a very good purchase in the cortical as well as the cancellous bone so if you want to insert this anchor we will insert this anchor right here what you need to do is you need to put one or two mallets like this okay and then you can just push it through and the thing you should realize is that when you push it you have to go up to the black mark so there are two black marks one is a straight line and one is the horizontal line and here we can see that if the black mark is in and when we leave it the screw is visible like, like uh, right here and they this is a 3 wo anchor so it is a triple loaded anchor so you can use all the three anchors for your repair so this is a screw which is there and there is no eyelet here and the fixation is both in the cortical as well as the cancellous bone so as compared if you are using a metal anchor titanium anchor then this is one of my preferential anchors because it gets preference fixation in both cortical and cancellous bone if the anchor has an eye then he it loses fixation in the cortical bone it has fixation only in the cancellous bone so this has got a very good pull out strength the second anchor i will be able to demonstrate is a why not rc this is an all suture anchor so this if you can see here is a all suture anchor now this anchor is basically a all suture anchor it's a double loaded anchor and the fixation of this anchor will depend on the intact cortical bone you can see it closely like here you can see that this is a anchor and the inserter is pointed so this is a self punching anchor so what you need to do is you need to just keep it like this keep the anchor here and hammer it and you can see that the anchor is going in okay so again there is a black line you can go up to the black line So we are fine. Fine. So once it is gone into the black line, we can just re remove it from here, like this, and then we'll just pull it out. Okay, that's it. So this inserter is basically has a very sharp teeth, which allows it to get the anchor inserted firmly. Again, this is a triple loaded anchor, very good pull out strength. but the strength is dependent on the very good cortical bone so this has to be used only when you have a very good cortical bone and you don't have to burr the bone to remove the cortical bone so again very good anchor but again it depends on the cortical bone fixation what you can do is now you can do a seesaw motion you can do a little little seesaw motion 
so that the anchor is stabilized there. So this is the second variety of anchor that we use in the cuff repair. Now I am coming to the third type. This is called as a cross FT 5.5 millimeter anchor. So this is a cross FT. So we have seen the metal titanium anchor. So if you have to use a titanium anchor, use preferably a super Evo or a 3 Evo anchor FT that is fully threaded. If you want to use a all suture anchor, you can use a Y not RC. And if you want to use a peak anchor, then you can use a cross FT. Now this is again has a cortico cancellous anchor. It has got a cancellous thread and a cortical thread. What you need to do is you need to just make a pilot hole here. So you just have to make a pilot hole and then you have to insert the anchor like you inserted the metal anchor. Again the fixation is good because you have got both cortical. So you, right now we have got the cancellous threads in and now we will be getting the uh, cortical threads into. And again it has got two black markings that you can use to fix up the anchors. And this way you can take them out. Okay. And again this is a three loaded or a triple loaded anchor. So a one good part about Lingvatec anchors is most of the anchors are available in a double low pattern but here you have a triple loaded anchor pattern which is available in metal, all suture and peak configuration. So all the three configuration you will get a triple loaded anchor and you can just do all your repairs using these triple row anchors. You can do your first generation repairs like a single row repair, you can do a double row repair by using a knotless pop lock anchor. So this is the pop lock inserter, we don't have a pop lock anchor right now. But pop lock is a very good anchor which is developed by Linvatec for the lateral row fixation that you can use for the lateral row. Or you can use these anchors in the lateral row also. So you can use a variety of techniques to repair the rotator cuff. So again, the innovations or the plus points about the Linvatec anchors is availability of both double loaded and triple loaded constructs. So you have anchors in available in all the spectrum in which you can use a triple loaded anchors. They have got the best titanium anchors because most of the other company titanium anchors are I anchors which lose purchase in the cortex. So this is a fully threaded 3 wo or a super revo anchor. So these are very good for purchase in the cortical bone. The all suture anchor is again very good because it is a self punching anchor but you need to take care that you are using it with the intact cortex. And then the peak anchor is always good because you can use a cross FT anchor. Cross FT anchor and this can be used in all sorts of uh, boots and it has got both cortical and cancellous purchase. Thank you.